What's most about her? Her heart, her kind soul, her loving ways. She loved her, her laugh. And she loved, she adored, adored her mother, just like I adored her. Days after human remains were found in Aliquippa, a family's worst fear is confirmed. Good evening and thank you for joining us tonight at 11. I'm Megan Schiller in for Ken Rice. State police tell us the body found in Aliquippa last week is a woman who had been missing for the last year and a half. The woman's family and friends gathered for a vigil tonight and only KDK's Jennifer Barrasso was there. Jen joins us live now with more details. Yeah, Megan, as you can imagine, it was an emotional night. Now, state police in Beaver County confirmed that the body discovered in this abandoned building behind me through dental records is that of Rakia Griffey. Now, the family, as you can imagine, is feeling some. Hello. Tonight in Aliquippa, heartbreak and pain. She lay here by herself. And we drove past her every day. Justice will be served for my cousin, whether it be by the law or by the Lord. Wherever she went, wherever she went, that her light shined it brighter than anything. She affected so many people, touched so many people. Family and friends gather to remember 24 year old Rakia Griffey. And I ask my God that you shine your love and your light around this family to carry them through. And Heavenly Father, as Rakia shines down her light, she sees this love and she is not struggling. Near the same spot where investigators found her body. Sources tell me an anonymous tip led investigators to this abandoned building along Sheffield and Fifth Avenue Thursday. They found Griffey's body under debris on the first floor, not far from where Griffey's mom, Rhonda Duke, says she was staying with her boyfriend. Duke tells me she dropped her daughter off there October 7th, 2022, and never saw her again. Now, the search for answers and justice. Justice for Kia. Justice for Kia. Justice for Kia. Does this bring you any kind of closure? I'm happy my baby is home safe with me and the good Lord, but now justice will prevail. I'm, I, I'm happy that she's safe now and I know where she is. Are there any theories about how she may have died? No. We're gonna let the scientists do their work and get to the bottom of this. Because again, justice shall prevail for Rakia Griffey. State police tell me that this is an open and active investigation. They are trying to figure out how Rakia Griffey died. Reporting live in Aliquippa, Jennifer Barrasso, KDK TV News.